Hi, this is Manuel, Delta Lima 2, Mike Alpha November. And this time I'm showing you another update of the micro SDX project. Um, in my case, it might be the final because, yeah, it's all I wanted to achieve with this thing. I finally managed to make it multi band. Now we have a multi band all mode rig for shortwave. Uh, in this case, it's 80 to 20 meters. And this has been done by adding um, the bottom PCB uh, instead of the uh, monoband um, low pass filter PCB to the rig, to the sandwich, to the Delta Lima 2 Mike Alpha November sandwich. And this is the PCB I designed. Uh, it contains three latching relays. Um, it has the low pass filters on it and there's the class E coil uh, inductor for PA and the shunt capacitor. So this is tuning the class E circuit. All this is being switched by the Artmega via I square C bus um, and we are using a GPIO expander to do that. Uh, Guido Papa Echo 1 November November Sulu was friendly enough to support me on that. Um, and actually it was his idea to use GPIO expander and he did the software for it really fast. Thank you Guido, thank you, thank you, thank you. Without you, yeah, there would not be such a project. All right, now I'm going to demonstrate that it works and how it works. If I go to band in the menu and switch it, listen for the clicking of the relays. Click, click. Now, 80 meter is active. Now, 40 meter is active. Uh, I'm, I'm sharing the 40 meter uh, low pass filter for 60 meter also because the uh, harmonics uh, suppression is still good enough. Uh, there's it's no clicking uh, to from 60 to 40 because now I'm I'm at the um, edge frequency of the low pass filter and when I'm going to 30 it's switching to the 20 meter low pass filter and 20 obviously my antenna is tuned to 20 meters so I will stay here for a second and yeah I just want to give you a short demonstration that it works looking that the frequency is free listening nothing going on As you can see, 5.3 watts going out on 20 meters. Ah, damn it, dear. So, this is it, it works. Um, yeah, the latching relays are three volt types. Uh, why? Because we are adding, we are uh, putting two calls in series. Those are latching relays. They have two calls, one for setting and one for resetting. And they are in series. Uh, so basically it's a six volt relay with one coil now. And you reverse the polarity of the, uh, of the, the coils. And uh, data sheet said it would require lower current that way. Uh, anyway, by using latching relays, uh, we only need current while switching, so for 15 milliseconds while changing band. Otherwise, this thing still consumes only 50 milliamps in receive. Uh, perfect portable radio, low current consumption. I will put the files for that in uh, the uh, UCX or micro SDX uh, group at groups.io. Uh, so you can build one for yourself and I will come up with a way so it can be easily built, maybe even supply a kit uh, via some Chinese uh, supplier. I don't know. Um, I, I need to have a look at that. Um, but development for now from the hardware side is finished. I will add a, a housing soon for that. And yeah, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really happy and proud that this worked. 
Thank you. Have a good time. Good luck. Good DX. 73. Tell Talima to Mike Alpha November.